Hello, today I'll be creating something like a breathing box. So we start with an SVG element and within it we have a path. Um, and from the SVG we also set a view box. Uh, let's say minus 200, minus 100, 400, 200. And I'm hard coding this because I don't really have uh, a choice and I'll have to uh, hard code stuff in the CSS to match the HTML anyway. So um, yeah not really a choice. If I could set the view box from uh, the CSS, that would be great, but I can't do that. So, okay. Now, here I'll be using a mixin. Um okay. Um and here I set um I start with a move to uh to the top left corner of a square that's going to be minus half the dimension and minus half the dimension. So minus half the dimension and I can just uh, copy paste for the y axis uh, the second dimension and next I'll draw a line down so um, this line down is going to have zero horizontal offset and vertical offset is going to be the whole edge length um, and next I'll copy paste this so um, copy paste this and Again, paste it again at the end. Now, this is going to be a horizontal line here, and let's um, start getting a feel for it. So, um, include the mixin. Okay. Now, this is going. This line is going to go back up, but the thing is, we don't want lines there. Uh, we want curves. So, uh, let's do that, and we need to add one more set of coordinates. So the horizontal offset uh, for that control point is going to be a quarter of the dimension uh, and the vertical offset is going to be half the dimension. So um, like this. And of course with minus when we go back. Okay, so now we have uh, our initial shape and let's uh, set some keyframes, um, breathe, two, um, and here I can add a sign. And this is one uh, by default initially, and I multiply with this sign right here. And here, when I include this, uh, I make the sign minus one. And now I can add in animation, uh, breathe, let's say half a second duration, uh, easing out, infinite, alternate. And um, this uh, should give us a breathing box. And it does, as you can see. This is what I wanted to show you for today. I hope you've enjoyed this video and if you have and you want me to be able to put out more stuff in the future and not end up dying in a trash can, please consider supporting my work. You can do it in one of the ways explained in the description. That's with a donation, there's a donation link there, or you can get me something off my Amazon wishlist, which is something that would make this kitty very happy. Or you can support the implementation of the cool stuff in here because this is SVG2 stuff which is only supported in Blink browsers for now. Or you can at least share this to show the world what can be done with CSS these days. Because honestly, I think it's pretty damn cool. It's 15 lines of code and, you know, just very basic SVG and Node.js. I think it's pretty damn cool. In any event, thanks for watching.